Survive the Night is a home invasion thriller film. This movie follows Rich as a surgeon, and he accidentally messes up a surgery and kills one of his patients. He is then sued, and he loses everything. So he's forced to move back home with his parents in a small town and get a tiny job at a medical clinic. And so there are these two robbers who are brothers, and they're fleeing the law, and they decide to rob a gas station. And while this robbery goes wrong, and one of the brothers gets shot in the leg. And while they can't obviously can't go to a hospital, they um, stake out the clinic that Rich works at. And when he gets off work, he follows him home. And when they get there, they round up the family, kidnap them, and they say, Hey, you're a doctor, you're going to fix my brother, or you're going to die. We're going to kill you and your family. Then things get out of hand and whatnot, and this movie goes down the drain. Now, this movie stars Bruce Willis, and let me just tell you, Bruce Willis, like most of his roles lately, it's just phoned in. I feel like this is just a cash grab for him. Like, he's not even trying. It's really sad. And all the other actors, they're really not that good either. This movie, the dialogue is absolutely terrible. It's so bad. It's it's so bad. And the camera shots, they're bad too. And there's just really nothing redeeming about this movie. There really is. All the characters, none of them are likable. And they're so stupid. If you watch this, you'll understand what I mean. Rich, the main guy, he is so dumb. He, It's ridiculous. The only good thing about this movie, I would have to say, is that I wasn't necessarily bored the whole time, but it didn't necessarily keep my interest either. There's really no need to see this unless it's on Netflix and you can watch it for free. Survive the Night gets three beards out of ten.